What's up everybody, today I'm gonna to show you the best and cleanest way to watch your TV shows and movies that you have legally the physical copies of, right? But I'm gonna show you how to get it done. Check it out. All right, so to get this going, the very first thing you need is a account with Torbox. Go ahead and just Google that, torbox.app. Now the cool thing about Torbox is you can get started for free. I definitely recommend you just start with a free one. Now there is a 10 downloads per month, 24 hour cooldown. So what that means is that you will need to wait 24 hours in between the downloads, but 10 gigs is enough for what we're doing today. So go ahead and get started for free. And then what I'm using personally is this $3 a month plan and I split it with two of my friends because you can have up to three concurrent slots and there is a per usage uh, you can you can buy more slots for like five bucks. So what you need to do is download Streamio. So Streamio has a lot of different binaries, uh, different installs. So the great thing is it is most likely natively available for whatever you're using. I'm using a Fire Stick. The way that you get that going is to use the Android TV version. Now, I use the Fire Stick 4K. I just use this very first APK. Works beautifully, no lags. So you'll need to make a free account um, to log in. But once you're logged in, check out this interface. I love it. So you have your most popular stuff here, very a la, you know, all the other streaming apps and TVs. And download or add the Torbox add-on. When you hit this configure button, it will take you to a web authentication URL and it will give you a notification that your add-on has been successfully authenticated. The cool thing is your Streamio account is uh, configured everywhere. So once you've set it up on one device, it'll be set up on your other devices. Let's, you know, if you're doing your 4K um, Fire Stick. The reason why that's such an advantage is on the Fire Stick, it's a pain in the ass to log into like two or three services. So just get into the Streamio, set it up on your phone, set it up on your computer. It'll be a lot easier. Let me show you the setup. How do I fucking stop this thing? What you want to do when you're setting it up for the Fire TV is two things. First, go into your apps. And you want to install Downloader. The way you get it for the first time is you just go through the official app store. There's no tricks or anything. It is just available. Go into search. And it is such a popular app. As soon as you just do D, it's the first choice. So you go here. Click on Downloader. and you install it. After you've downloaded Downloader, you'll actually need to enable the developer options. Sometimes in older versions, you can just select on or off. Um, otherwise, you'll need to spe specify the application and turn it on for that application. Once you've done that, jump into Downloader. You're going to search for Streamio. Just go ahead and Google it. And for Fire Stick TV, the version that you want is actually going to be the Android TV version. So there's going to be a couple of different versions. Look at, you know, Google what your device might use, but the ARM version is what we want. So with a little bit of good luck, you'll be able to download it, install it, and it should come up with this screen here. And let's go ahead and hit open. Excellent. The hard part is done. The last thing you'll want to do is log into your account. Um, you can use your phone for that. It will take a second to load. Grabbing the first link. And Shadaisy. It is so clean. It works so well. So I thought this was cool as hell. Um, it is, again, you can share it uh, with friends. And even though it says three concurrent downloads is like the max, I think um, you could share it with like five or six friends because what are the odds that every single person is watching something at the same time? You know, I work 
days friends work nights um not everyone's watching something every single day but either way you can download more slots or sorry you can purchase more slots it's like three dollars for five more slots and then you are good to go so for eight bucks a month you have unlimited for the entire family i mean really three bucks a month but um yeah i hope you think it's as cool as i did because i thought it was freaking amazing and uh you know of course like subscribe i really need it i only have like 500 subscribers and uh i <laughs> please 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 sir can i have some more likes thank you